What's up guys welcome back to ifx tech today we're going to demonstrate how to replace the lcd screen on your lenovo team pack e14 or e16 let's get to it disconnect the power adapter press the power button to turn on the system Tap the F1 key repeatedly to enter the BIOS setup menu. Select the config menu. Select the power option from the list. Select disable built-in battery and click yes in the confirmation box. The system will shut down and the battery is disabled. Loosen 7 captive screws. Pry up the edges of the cover to release the clips. Lift the cover from the system. Disconnect the battery cable from the system board. Disconnect the EDP cable touch panel cable from the system board. Disconnect the antenna cables from the wireless line. Tight remove the antenna cables from the guides on the system fan. For the E14, remove two screws from the inch on top of the system board. For the E16, remove three screws from that hinge. Move two screws from the hinge on top of the I.O. board. Tilt the bottom half of the system up and remove it from the LCD unit. Carefully pry up the clips along the bezel and remove it from the LCD unit. Carefully pull the tape out from the bottom two corners of the LCD panel. Carefully pull the tape out from the top two corners of the LCD panel. of the LCD panel and flip it over. Disconnect the EDP cable from the panel and remove it. Place adhesive tapes onto the four corners of the LCD unit with the tabs sticking out the top and bottom edges.
Place the LCD panel upside down next to the LCD unit and connect the EDP cable to the panel. Remove the protective covers from the adhesive tapes. Flip the panel over and place it into position on top of the tape and lightly press it down. Insert the EDP cable into the guides. Align the bezel with the LCD unit and press down on the clips. Align the bottom of the system with the LCD unit and pivot the hinges down onto the system. Stall two screws into the hinge on top of the I.O. board. For the E14, install two screws into the hinge on top of the system board. For the E16, install three screws into the hinge. Insert the antenna cables into the guides on the system fan. Connect the black antenna cable to the auxiliary terminal on the wireless LAN card. Connect the gray antenna cable to the main terminal on the wireless LAN card. Connect the EDP cable and touch panel cable to the system board. Connect the battery cable to the system board. Place the cover onto the chassis and press down around the edges to snap the clips into place. Tighten the seven captured screws to secure the cover.